Hey everyone, welcome back to another haul. Today's haul is going to be home bargains. I've not been in there for a long time, but I did find some amazing things. But before I start, I just want to pre-warn you that it's summer holidays, kids are off. You can imagine. And also, <laughs> the only place I can find to film is by my bedroom window, which has builders outside. So let's hope. Okay, so I've got a couple of bags here and a basket for stuff. This basket is amazing. I just yes. Okay, so I'm just gonna pull out. So this is a removable chalkboard wall sticker, 145 centimeters by 45 centimeters, trim to size, non-toxic, and it includes chalk, which I didn't realize it actually did, but it's actually in there, in the bottom there. So I thought this would be great for the smaller kids room, they can stick it somewhere, they can chalk away, they can have great fun. Jensen loves to play schools, so that would be really good for him. Um, at the moment they're using the cupboard door, it's like ruining the cupboard, so this is going to go up on the wall somewhere and I'm really looking forward to getting that stuck up, I'll probably do it today actually. Um, pegs, 36 plastic clothes pegs, they were £1.19, they did have like multi colours as well, but I've preferred the grey, they're just pegs, but even then you're like, I'll go for them more. I lose them, literally, I'm not even joking, I'll buy a pack and they'll be all over the garden covered in mud, so for £1.19 it doesn't really matter. Bin liners, got some bin liners because always need them, 18 for 99p, tie handle ones, um, 70 litre. I don't know why, but Sainsbury's and all that are so expensive, like nearly £3 for bin liners and I go through them rapidly, so 99p, can't go wrong. The reason I went down there was to get these tiles because I bought packets of them last month and I'm one short because I've done the bathroom and I'm one packet, well, three tiles short, but you get five in a pack. I think they're £2.00. 249 I think they are. Yeah, 249 for five. They stick so easily. Although I have been putting um, my own glue underneath them just to give them an extra hold. Um, but they stick so easy. They cut really easy. I've had no problems with them at all. So these are brilliant. 249, they're much better than the Poundland ones. They are good, but these ones are definitely better. So actually I think these are cheaper than the Poundland ones now because they're not a pound anymore. They've got shower curtains in there for £3.99. Now, we've got two shower curtains. One, because our bath and shower is right next to the window, we have um, a shower curtain across the window, and then obviously the one in the, which can be awful if it's cold, and like, especially when Nick comes in and wraps the curtain around me. They've got pink ones, all different designs. They've got pink ones, they've got like a mustard, they've got snazzy designs. This one was my favorite for £3.99. It's really go, 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 go with the theme. Um, but that's the design, it's black and white, and that one's going to go, I think this one will probably go in the window, or I might switch them around and put the white one in the window and have this one, but 180 centimetres by 180 centimetres, with plastic hooks, where's the hooks, oh they are in there, that's all good, yeah so if you're looking for a shower curtain then that is a really good place to look because they just don't last. I don't know about anybody else, but they just don't last in our house, especially with me dyeing my hair all the time. Um, the bottom of the shower curtain just ends up like orange, and I don't know why it ends up orange. I've done the whole bleaching, putting in a dishwasher tablet, in the washing machine and all that, and it still doesn't come out that great, so 3 99 just get another one. What I really love about going to these places is the cleaning stuff. Like, I can go in there and I could spend hours just looking at the cleaning stuff. I found these toilet bowl fizz and fresh. So you get eight tablets, drop in one tablet, no scrubbing, for 20, it dissolves in there for 20 minutes and cleans your toilet. They've got, they had lemon, they had eucalyptus and I went for pink peony fresh. That's what the box is. So I thought I'm going to give them a go. I love anything, I love going to room to room to room and it just smells really, really nice. So I've got some cleaning stuff today. Another one is this Fabulosa. I love Fabulosa. It smells so good. Can't remember how much this was. I think it was 1.99. Yeah. 
$1.99 um, laundry cleanser there was only two left and one of them was damaged so this one um, it just says one love it's vegan smells beautiful so oh it smells really really nice I'm looking forward to the next load actually this is going in because I really want to know how it comes out they had a range of these I think they're 89 pence yeah they are 89p for this it's garden party fabulosa ready to use disinfectant the smell of this is amazing like it smells really indulgent like it doesn't smell nasty like a cleaning chemically product it smells really indulgent which is what we all want isn't it so when i get smells like this it just encourages me to clean even more like i just can't stop cleaning i've got so many sprays and whatnot but I couldn't resist that. They had others in there. There was like a purple. No, it was like a red liquid with a purple sticker. And it smelled so bad. I don't even know how they can get away with, with, with selling that. It's just, it was not pleasant at all. I'm going to get these out of the way because these are pretty boring. But breadsticks. I think they were. F how much were they? 59p or something. But it's three for a pound. Italian breadsticks. And we've already started started on them in the car on the way home power action general purpose rubber gloves i've got them in medium because i can't stand them they're really tight and then you can't get them off properly and they go inside out so i always get a little bit bigger 69p for some pink medium gloves there's some cleaning action going on today that's for sure um what have i got in here oh ooh, these these are ice cream bowls with the ice cream spoons. They are so cute. Look at the spoons, look. So you get four bowls, four spoons, and I just thought they'd be so much nicer rather than keep using, sometimes we use cups, you know, like plastic, um, plastic cup things, or it's always the cereal bowls. It's just like, It'd just be so much nicer to have these, so I got those. They were £2.49, I think they were. Let's have a look. Yeah, £2.49. And they're really cute. You've got pink, yellow, red and blue. I picked up batteries in my Primark haul, and um, I love that Primark haul. If you haven't seen it, you need to go and check that out, because mm, I've got some beautiful clothes. Anyway, I've got the AA batteries, but they don't fit, and what I need them for is this. I bought packets of these from Poundland, I think it was. It might have been actually home bargains. I'm not sure, but they take triple A's. So I picked up the wrong ones. I've just gone and bought these from in there. You get eight in a pack and then 95p. So I thought, bargain. I'm thinking of putting them underneath the, underneath the kitchen cabinets. So you can just flick them on. It looked really, really nice. But yeah, I've got four of those. So enough batteries. Actually, Jensen was really helpful because he was with me and I was like, I'll just get one pack, we need one. And he was like, no, it takes three. I was like, of course it does. Your maths is better than mine. Right, I've got some real random bits here. Anyway, let's get this out of the way. So the box is downstairs, but Jensen really wanted this. It's $8.99 and you're going to love it. If you've got kids, you're going to love this because as it goes along, it just makes that noise. It's a lawnmower. And it's from three years up, comes with accessories, so you've got your little rake. And we are going to be doing some gardening, so I think he just put the... thought, yeah, I really want to take part, join in, and he wanted this. But I've got the... where is it? Extra bits here. It's got your little, um, little spade thing and the other plastic cutters. For eight ninety nine. it's really... It's not going to last five minutes, but eight ninety nine. it's going to keep him happy for maybe... Days. <laughs> flip flops for 149 Jensen wanted them. Um yeah, all different colours, all different designs. He wanted the sharp ones. £1.49. They're they're quite sturdy actually, they're not really thin and flimsy, so hopefully they'll last for a bit. Um I've got some bits in here. I've just had to send my little one out because they're actually for him. Just like little extras for his birthday because it's coming up. This little notebook. It has little, um, what are they called? Fidget poppers. It's got one on the front. 
which I'm assuming you can take it out and you can just play with it. I don't know. But it was, I think it was one ninety nine. Yeah, it was one ninety nine for that. And they had a, like a more girly type one as well with like the um, pastel colours, really pink. But I went for that one. Um, 99p for 30. So keep them busy for a little bit. Oh God, why do I do it to myself? A pound, six flutes. That was a big mistake. Uh, I picked up a card for 79p. It's Batman, because he loves Batman. I'm wondering if he's at the door, so I'm trying to be a little bit quiet. I have a plan. If it's going to work, I don't know. Probably not, but I'm going to be keeping an eye on this. I got this. It was £2.49 £2 for 100, 1,500ml glass jar. Okay, so it pops open. Oh god, it smells like fish. Oh, that's going to need washing. Badly wa I mean, I wash it anyway, but that needs serious washing. My kids are arguing. Anyway, the plan is to stop letting them have sweets. Like, you know you go to the sweet shop and they go, choose what you want. Instead of that, I'm going to fill the jar with sweets and then they can only have some every now and again. Not like, not continuously getting sweets. I thought I'd be like, and it's not easy to get into. Like, I would hear it as well. I'd hear that. <sighs> All right, boys. So, yeah. And I've got a load of sweets to put in it as well. Probably my favourite thing that I grabbed, which was this, it was four pounds four four forty nine. Um, it's this fabric storage basket, and they have the boxes as well, so they're like flat packs uh, for four ninety nine. You can get the boxes as well, but it's this. I mean, look, it's gorgeous. It's quite big. You can get a lot in there. And it's got these fake leather handles. They had a lighter grey as well, but I wanted the um, the black. And it's all fabric. Really, really nice. I've got some ideas for what I want to do with it, but I'm not 100% certain on where I'm putting it just yet. I just knew that I just wanted to grab this one. I think this was the last black one. Black one's quite popular, more so than the light grey. Does anybody else go into Home Bargains? Just look at all the treats and the... the the, the naughty area and just be like yeah and you find some unusual stuff but not only that you think it's cheap but the size is actually smaller i've got cherry drops i haven't seen cherry drops in years i don't know if the packaging is still the same inside quite similar oh that so reminds me of when i was younger yeah, these were 89p, so I grabbed those, you get a pack of four. Also got four of these, these were 39p each, these are a little treat for later. Um, just a little candy floss, got four of those. And two of these, these were 99p each, 22 little lolly things, um, 99p a bag. Vitamin C and natural colourings. There's nothing good about these whatsoever. So they are, they are not for delving in. These are all going in the jar, not the candy floss. Um, well, I've got all this. Jensen chose this because I was not sure about this one at all. But to be fair, the shelves were pretty empty in that section. I think it is because all the kids are off school. So it's called a Barra Booty Bag. No artificial colours or flavours. Just look. It's just got lollies and all sorts in there. 400 gram bag, and that was 179. Dexter's strawberry diner sticks, strawberry flavored candy. Um, I'm really getting it today now that like the builders are going for it. I should just lean out the window, but excuse me. Can you give me five minutes? Because I'm filming. Yeah, I'm um, not sure how much this one was actually. I haven't got my glasses with me, so I'm really struggling to see how much they actually were. Oh, here we are. One fifty nine. It's one pound fifty nine for that tub. It's like when you go into the shop and they're like, "That's ten p each." 
That was 10p each. I wonder how much it would be. Yeah. Pano Chocolats, always getting them, but two of them are already gone. Um, these ones are really nice, actually, because they go. the pastry really crumbles. Um, they were £1.19 for six. They only have one packet. Normally, I buy about four or five packets at a time. That, that was the last packet. They had these. These were one twenty nine, I think they were. Um, brio, brio, brioche, brioche, brio, brio. I don't know how you pronounce that. But those little chocolate chip round things. I'm thinking they'd be really nice if you warm them up a little bit. Yeah, and they're individually wrapped as well, so I'll remember that for when they go to school because they'd be good for packed lunches. We've got two for a pound on the double chocolate Maryland cookies, so the best. I can devour a whole packet with one cup of tea. God, yes. Yeah. What else have I got? Ew. Jensen wanted pink wafers. I've never liked pink wafers in my life. They are just... It's like putting sawdust in your mouth. Yeah, he wanted to try them. So I think they were like 59p or something. Two packets of these, which are 59p a pack. Can you get four? I love heating these up and putting ham and cheese and all that in them. Oh, crusty in 10 minutes. Now you need to take them out of the oven slightly before they're due. I've just found some sponges in the bag. Um, yeah, 39p for the um, the massage type ones. You know, you get the bristly on one side, thighs, thighs on that side, soft on the other. So I grabbed a couple of those for 39p each. 89p for these. Love those. Pound a bag. They had loads of different flavours, but these are the best by far. So I got one for me, one for Nick. dinner <laughs> no not dinner these are um 59p for a chub roll i got a beef one and a chicken one chase really likes them like really like he won't eat any dog food but he will eat these so gross they eat everything <sighs> yeah it all came to £62.42. But yeah. Um, oh, cereal. I've got a box of cereal. They're £1.19. But they're vegan. Vegetarian vegan. Um, chocolate squares. So it's like Crave. Oh my god, it sounds like smashing stuff. I don't know. But I was always calling them pillows. But anyway, yeah, £1.19. And apparently you can get 12 bowls in there. But there's no way you're going to get 12 bowls in there four if you're lucky but yeah that was everything thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you all again in my next one i'm gonna go and put all this away now and um yeah tackle the garden so thanks for watching